In this video, we are going to learn how to calculate the horizontal distance a projectile travels if we know the initial velocity with which it was launched and the angle at which it was launched. So look at the example at the top of the page. A projectile is launched with an initial velocity of 45 feet per second at an angle of 38 degrees. What horizontal distance will the projectile travel? So here's the example from, here's the formula from our PowerPoint that shows horizontal distance can be found by doing the initial velocity squared times the sine of 2 theta all divided by negative g. G in this example, if we notice, there's an important piece of information here that our initial velocity was 45 feet per second. So this is going to give me a tip because we're in U.S. customary measurement that instead my constant for the gravitational acceleration, we're going to use the U.S. Um, units. So we will be using negative 32 for this um, constant. So I'm going to start down here by putting in my equation, x equals, I'm going to fill in the variables that I know. My initial velocity was 45 feet per second squared. And then the sine of 2 times my angle, the angle was 38 degrees. And we're going to divide by the opposite of my gravitational constant, which is negative 32 feet per second. And again, I'm using the 32 because I'm in U.S. Uh, units of measurement with, as given by my initial velocity. So when I simplify this, I get 45 squared is 2,025. And then I'm going to do times the sine of 76 because that's twice 38 degrees. And I'm going to divide by 32. So in my calculator, I'm typing in 2025 times the sine of 76, and I get 1,964.849 divided by 32. And my projectile will travel 61.402 feet away from where it's launched.